Hello everyone and welcome, my name's Ali A and uh, today we are finally, finally, I've got around to play Die Rise Zombies for you guys to do a full playthrough on this beautiful, wonderful map. It is, really is the coolest map for Black Ops 2 Zombies, it is epic. Um, the reason it's taken so long is the sort of time management and stuff, I really wanted to do a full playthrough like this as soon as the map came out and I'm going to say 99% I'm going to do it for the next uh, Black Ops 2 Zombies map, a full proper playthrough with parts and such so you can see me progressing. Once there is of course the next DLC Zombies, uh, I'll do that a lot quicker than I've done for this one, but uh, Die Rise, this map is awesome and uh, they've done a great job. The Zombies guys, wow that's a fail, uh, the Zombies guys uh, making this map, it's very much like a Black Ops um, 1 Zombies map, so that's very cool indeed, and uh, it's just epic, it's not a transit map or anything like that, which is cool because I think a lot of people are, you know, mixed feelings about transit maps, and when I went to um, the Treyarch Studios and played this map, the first thing I said to the guys was like, is it a, is it a transit map? They didn't tell me, I just played it, I thought, okay, it's not a transit map, but um, it's basically just an enhanced survival map which is awesome and everyone really enjoys that I think and they've definitely done a, a good move with this map and uh, I'm really looking forward to what they do with the other maps. We may not even see another transit map, who knows, um, because you know if people don't like it that much, unless they improve it dramatically and change the way it works completely, we may never see another transit map. So that's, that's an interesting fact for you guys. It's not a fact, it's just an opinion, just like what could happen I guess. Um, but a lo there are loads also of uh, setting up methods for this map and um, you've got to be careful with the um, method you choose because of course you're limited in terms of how you get around the map. Oh, wow, hello there buddy. Uh, because of the lifts. Wow, why are these zombies? Oh, okay, round two, I'm being a muppet. Um, so let's just freaking go in here actually because I need a few more points. Gonna knife that guy and then I'm gonna be super, super careful and fall down here. Thank you. I'm gonna buy that and then I'm also gonna buy, push myself against the wall and buy that which is cool. So I'm gonna chill here for a little bit. This is gonna be my setup for this map. There's lots of setups but if you guys enjoyed the first part definitely give it a likes up, thumbs up. In my last video I said give me a thumbs, give me a thumbs like or something with like that but if you guys enjoyed the first part especially I really appreciate all the support on it. Uh, so thank you to all of you guys who enjoy my zombies videos but the setting up methods are, are quite a few and especially, oh just three points for this nuke so that's cool. Um, especially for solo because you've got this lift going up and down you can technically make the buildable which is on the floor I think you may be able to fall down there but I'm not going to give it a go I don't want to go down there which is of course on the floor below you can build the flipper thing in my bobby which is cool and that's really useful in, for several reasons it's just a great item in general um, you can build that faster and you can also build turn on the power build a slick fire nice and early on but this is a good method for chilling around here um, because if you chill around here, you can just build up your points to the PDW, you've got the PDW on the wall, the PDW is a beast nonetheless, um, so it's just to, a, a good gun to start off with anyway, uh, that's why I like using it, and of course, um, once you build up your points, it then means that I'm going to progress to the power room next, but I'm not going to go there immediately like you can do, pardon me, um, oh, insta-kill, I didn't mean to get that, but whatever, I think what I, no, nah, I can't be bothered, I was going to, I'm going to do the method where you just don't kill anyone and then I think the next time the insta-kill comes up it, you get a red insta-kill as well which means when you hit them with your body you get a get a kill which is quite useful in some cases but I'm just going to go for the kills here um, but it is a very very cool map there's lots of places I know of where you can chill in for one area uh, and just get zombies running around you in circles which is very cool indeed one of them just being right here actually just get a slick with fire gun don't open this here just sit there and keep on shooting the um, keep on shooting the floor down here and it's you know it's a bit boring to watch I guess so I'll try and go to a place where it takes a little bit of skill to run around and I've never been about just you know high rounds that's like I think one of the reasons it took me a while to get into it and to play this map properly is because everyone was rushing to high doing high rounds and stuff and I was like I don't really want to be the person that just goes for high rounds I've never been the person that goes for high rounds I just enjoy playing zombies for fun so that's what I've always been about for zombies is having fun and enjoying zombies so that's what I'm going to continue to do for you guys here, and um, we're going to leave that max ammo, actually, mm, you know, now I want to pick it up, I want to use my pistol to get some more more points from my pistol instead, so I'm going to shoot into them with my pistol, wow, that zombie's got a, I think it's one of the zombies actually with the uh, protection vest thing, so that's why it's probably got a little bit more point, a little bit more points, a little bit more health than the other guy, so... 
And meh. I may shoot into the other guys as well. And pop out here again. Just going to keep on shooting into these guys. I remember the first time I played this map actually at Treyarch was... And the TV settings they had for all their TVs was really TV settings. The darkness, darkness settings they have was on the maximum. So that I couldn't even tell where I was going in some cases. It's because of how freaking dark the TV was. But I'm going to keep on shooting into that guy. And wow, okay, I see how it is, bud. Let's go and take that guy down. And these guys down as well. Um, I think... God, I don't even know... Whew. I think, hopefully this goes up, hopefully, come on, damn it's going down, I think, because what I want to do, ooh, that was quick, I will take that, what I want to do now is set up with the power straight away, um, and you don't want to put any damage into the zombies, um, if it's the final zombie, because when they die, if they either, you go to a different location where they have to respawn back on the map, like they are doing now, um, why are they... Why are they running? That's not very nice. <coughs> then, um, is there any parts there? Nope. Let's go and get over here. Then if they've got any damage in them when they get hit by the elevator or anything like that. Juggernaut, please be near. Oh, damn it, I've got to hope that one's Juggernaut. I'm going to kill this one because it's a freaking running zombie. And I don't like running zombies. They're a little bit quicker, but they're certainly not running zombies, which is cool. So, I want to find Juggernaut. That's my mission now. So, try and find Juggernaut. I guess he's gone down... I don't know. I want, it, I want it to go up. I'll try and make it go up. See what happens. Come on. Has it gone down? I think it's gone down. Oh, wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the frick? The frick am I catching myself on? Okay, so it's probably best to go and build the Soliquifier, actually, having said that. I'm going to check if there's any items up here. There is. There's one here. Oh, man. There's another one. There's another one here? No, it's cool. Okay. And what you can do... Oh, that was cheeky. Let's drop down here, put this part in here, just hope the zombies don't spawn near me. There's another zombie, yep, another part over here. And there's going to be another part there, another part upstairs. So we can build a slick fire nice and quickly as well. This is a good thing about staying here. Uh, sorry, staying in the place of the PDW initially, just so you have points to get around to make the slick fire. Otherwise, you're just stuck here. And you're like, oh, you can't build it, which kind of sucks. So we're going to go upstairs now and grab the final part. And then we're going to have a PDW. And we're going to grab this and a slick fire as well, which is awesome. Which is a good setup. And oh man, that zombie's going to be a pain to go past, isn't he? Oh wow, that's cheeky. Cheeky! I'm going to have to drag them upstairs, I think. And since there's two of them at least, one, the last one isn't sprinting madly. But I'm going to have to bring them around here. And once I've brought them around here, then go back and add in the final parts. So the slick fire is definitely worth building. Probably one of the best weapons on this map. Really, really good. What the frick is the other zombie doing? Being super slow, that's what he's doing. Oh, ouch, that hurt. Thank you, not really appreciated. I'm going to run past them here. Because, of course, you've got to spend time putting this part into the location. If you didn't know where the locations were for Slick Fire, I'm pretty sure you do. Then I've done a video on it already, just in case you didn't know. Um, let's go and grab that. Uh, nope. Nope. Hmm, okay. What we're gonna have to do here is maybe just chill around for a little bit. I'm not sure. I want to see. I want to know where Juggernog is. That's the biggest thing, to be honest. Juggernog is massive because uh, you want to get it as quickly as possible, and of course you can't tell where it is. You just have to hope that it appears. I think it's that one. Oh yes, baby. Just as I say, you just have to hope it appears. It freaking appears in front of us. Okay, sweet. Now I don't want to start shooting zombies here. That would kind of suck. So. Man, these lifts are moving quickly. I wonder if there's a pattern to the speed. I know one of the maps. I'm thinking of a certain game where things move at different speeds depending on when you enter the map and stuff. I don't even think it's um, zombies, to be honest. I'm not sure. I think it's a Mario level, actually. I don't know why I'm thinking about that. But whatever. Does this go up? I really want to go up. Come on. Yeah, buddy. Sweet. Okay, now we're going to go up to the roof, I think. Maybe? Or where's another good point to go to? Where did I want to go to? Huh. I know where I want to go to. Okay. We're going to try... Actually, damn it. I can't... Hmm. Hmm. place I want to go to is over there, but you need the flipper to get back over there. Um... Trying to think. I don't know if you can... Can you just jump that normally? Maybe you can. 
I'm trying to think. Okay, let's just try and jump it normally. Yeah, that's cool. Um, what's over there? Okay, speed code is over there. We can... I think what I'm going to do is go this way. I'm going to have to make sure we make it, which we do. Sweet. And... Uh, this way. Yeah, so we could go over here. Uh, where's the falling down part I want to get to? Uh, God, this map sometimes... I lose my positioning so easily. Um, we want to fall down here, I believe. And then... No, we don't want to go that way. <laughs> Lol. No, thank you. And the power room. Yes, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Got to be careful when you're falling down, of course. You don't get screwed up by the zombies. And then... Nice. Okay, so cool. Now we're back down here, which is where I want to be. This is the room, I think, that I want to be in. Oh, wow, I don't have enough points for it. Damn you, zombie. Okay, we have to kill these guys here. Rebuild some... This is all the setting up process. This is the this is the part which is which is uh, tricky. You've got to be careful getting it right. But it is such a cool map. I mean, look at it. Really, really, really cool map. Mm -hmm.